Top 10 Deadly Viruses and Bacteria Generated in Labs Number 10. Horsepox Scientists at the University of Alberta have created horsepox, a lethal virus closely related to the equally deadly smallpox. Unlike smallpox, horsepox does not affect humans and is only fatal to horses. The scientists created the virus during a six-month study sponsored by pharmaceutical company Tonix. The researchers purchased DNA pieces via mail order and arranged them to form the virus. The entire project was not expensive. The DNA pieces used to create the virus cost just $100,000. Number 9. Black Death Between 1347 and 1351, millions of Europeans were afflicted with a mysterious disease that killed over 50 million people. Today, we know this disease is the Black Death, which is caused by the Yersinia pestis bacteria. Although the Black Death is still around, it is not as potent as it used to be. A few years ago, researchers from several schools, including the University of Tübingen in Germany and McMaster University in Canada, recreated the deadly bacteria from DNA samples extracted from the teeth of a victim who died during the plague. They got only 30 mg of the bacteria from the teeth, but that was enough to recreate it. Number 8. Polio. Like their partners at the University of Alberta, researchers at the State University of New York have made a fatal counterfeit infection by purchasing DNA pieces by means of mail request. This time, it is polio, and it is as strong as the regular one. Mice presented to the counterfeit polio became ill similarly as they would have whenever presented to normal polio. The research facility made polio was disputable among researchers. The specialists who created it had taken its code from information bases accessible to nearly anyone. Different analysts dread that individuals with ulterior thought processes could build up their own counterfeit polio, which is a lot simpler to make than different perilous infections like smallpox. Number 7. Mousepox. A couple of years back. Analysts at the Australian National University and the Commonwealth Scientific and Industrial Research Organization, CSIRO, delivered a lethal changed strain of mousepox accidentally. Mousepox is another deadly infection that has a place with a similar family as horsepox and smallpox. The specialists were attempting to create contraception for mice at the time that they erroneously made the infection. They embedded a quality that advanced the production of interleukin-4, IL-4, into mousepox, which they infused into certain mice. The mice were immunized and shouldn't be hurt by the mousepox. Number 6. SARS 2.0 Serious intense respiratory condition, SARS, is a deadly infection. In excess of 700 individuals were executed during a SARS scourge that contaminated 8,000 individuals in 29 nations somewhere in the range of 2002 and 2003. Presently, researchers have made it deadlier. The new freak SARS infection was made by a gathering of scientists drove by Dr. Ralph Barrick of the University of North Carolina. They call it SARS 2.0. The specialists built up the infection by adding some protein to the normally happening SARS. SARS 2.0 is resistant to antibodies and medicines used to fix the normally happening SARS virus. Number 5. Mizrabi's Virus Hybrid. Researchers have made a Mizrabi's crossbreed infection. The thought is to utilize the infection to build up an antibody that will shield us from both infections. Rabies is a savage sickness that can be sent to people through the nibbles of tainted canines that generally have the infection in their saliva. Middle East Respiratory Syndrome, MERS, is another infection that showed up in Saudi Arabia a couple of years back. It is firmly identified with SARS and is spread from bats to camels and, at last, to people. MERS contaminated 1,800 individuals at the hour of its first pestilence and killed more than 630. Its casualty rate is around 35%. Number 4. Phyx 174. 
FIX174 is another counterfeit infection we have delivered in research centers. It was made by analysts at the Institute of Biological Energy Alternatives in Rockville, Maryland. The analysts demonstrated the counterfeit infection after the normal FIX infection. FIX is a bacteriophage, a class of infections that taint and eliminate microorganisms. Notwithstanding, it has no impact on humans. The specialists made the counterfeit infection in 14 days, yet it looks like the common infection so much that it is difficult to reveal to them separated. The analysts trust that the new infection is the initial phase in creating freak and fake microorganisms that can be utilized to assist man. Number 3. Unnamed Virus Scientists from University College London and the National Physical Laboratory have made an anonymous infection that eliminates microscopic organisms and carries on like a genuine infection. Like FIX174, it is a bacteriophage however deadlier. The anonymous infection assaults any microorganisms around it. In no time, it breaks into more modest parts that Append and make openings on the groups of the microscopic organisms. The openings immediately become bigger, constraining the microorganisms to release their substance. The microorganisms bite the dust before long. Number 2. Bird Flu. Some Dutch researchers have made a freak and deadlier form of the all-around deadly winged creature influenza. Regular fledgling influenza isn't handily sent among people. Notwithstanding, the analysts modified it so it very well may be. To test their new infection, the scientists presented a few ferrets to it. Ferrets were picked in light of the fact that they had comparative flying creature influenza side effects to humans. Ten ages later, the all-around changed infection transformed again and got airborne. Regular fledgling influenza isn't an airborne infection. The investigation was questionable in the science network. It turned out to be significantly more so when the Dutch analysts endeavored to distribute the cycle to make the savage virus. Number 1. H1N1 Virus In 1918, the world saw the appearance of a savage influenza pestilence. This was the H1N1 infection. When it was finished, up to 100 million individuals were dead. Seasonal influenza made blood saturate the lungs of casualties. They delivered blood from their noses and mouths prior to suffocating in the blood inside their lungs. The influenza returned in 2009. Yet, it was less deadly despite the fact that it was transformed and deadlier than it ought to have been. Researcher Yoshi Okawaoka took tests of the changed strain that made the 2009 pandemic and utilized it make a deadlier strain that was impervious to antibodies. This strain was like the one that caused the 1918 epidemic. COVID-19 Thank you very much for watching our video.